Hello YouTube, welcome back to a new Clash Royale video. For today's video, I recently, well not recently, but I say uh, two weeks ago, I hit a new record. 2,586. I dropped like 300 plus trophies. But as of now, I have the record for the highest level one free to play player confirmed there has been a uh, low level one players that have made it to 3k and surpassed 2700 and such but they've all gen and i'm the first free to play player level one to ever make it that high and it's crazy considering i only have two legend legendaries and most level ones that crack uh 2600 have like four legendaries and like powerful epics so i'm gonna do a couple of matches just real quick i'm in a new clan and i checked that the clan had a 10 out of 10 clan chest that's what i really want right now only clan that could get 10 out of 10 chest so every uh season or every week when they release the challenge i have the opportunity to get a 10 out of 10 chest and increase my chances of getting a legendary card so my opponent with no clan starts off with a sparky in the back and i have a t i have a terrible starting hand right there I had a terrible starting hand. I didn't have my dragon in cycle. Hopefully the crown tower can lock on. And it does. Oh. Ooh. So he's going for the three crown, obviously. Huh, okay. If it's let's run me have a zap ready. Oh, that's value. That's tower down. I'm gonna drag the baby dragon over. Wow. He clutched it with the giant. <laughs> Maybe, hopefully the Sparky gets a shut off. On the archers. I get to prepare for his balloon. And I lost. Hmm. That's because I had a bad uh, starting hand. Hmm. Wow. I set the new record as a free to play low one. And now I'm losing terribly. Kinda sucks. But I really do wish that I got more uh, legendaries.
I'm gonna drop a bowler in the back. And at this angle, it should uh, line up uh, in a straight line. And yeah, take care of any troops ahead. Okay, perfect. So he has a very splash heavy deck. There's still, if he has minion horde, that's the one counter against Sparky that's OP. Oh, and I saved the Sparky. The Sparky should get a couple, one more shot, there you go. Oh yes, we can take care of the witch. And the one skeleton. I feel like I, there's always one skeleton that causes trouble. I've had uh, situations where the Sparky targets a single skeleton and it's so annoying. No shots. But that's a negative electric trait. I should uh, kind of misplaced the inferno there. Oh, and I misplaced the Sparky as well. GG. Huh. I had a few misplaced there, but I still ended up pulling out the win. Plus 30. I'm gonna go for the crown chest against ISO or ESO. Level 7. I have a pretty good starting hand. And when I play on this account, I play on the phone, so the screen is much smaller, and my fingers sometimes get in the way. But in a way, it's kind of better because um, uh, it's easier to drag things around the map. But on the iPad, which is where I have my main account, it's easier to drag. Uh, troops uh, across the arena because the f your fingers don't gain away. So you dropped uh, four and four. That's and then that's two right there. That was a good uh, defense on my part, splitting the fire spirits in the middle. And this tower is getting a lot of damage. Run out of the elixir advantage. Because he, he probably thought I was low on elixir. So he decided to split the, uh, his push. Valkyrie on one side and Skeleton Army on, on the other. He has Pekka. And there's no sign of Minion Horde. Minion Horde and Air Decks are the are the decks I usually struggle 
with That's another tower down. Second three crown. Mm, second three crown. I wonder how much uh, more crowns I need. Probably, not uh, probably like two or one. And the game is loading slowly. Eighty-five, a hundred. Uh, two more crowns. Okay. I really want the Inferno Dragon with Princess and Ice Wizard just to counter Lava Hound, cause that's the one deck I struggle most against. With the Sparky, uh, it's great counter against Giant and Golem decks, as well as Pekka. And a positive elixir trade three for two. I'm up one. Okay, we're gonna have the elixir advantage. Oh, I hate that. The, okay, I only got one shot. He wasted a ton of elixir. He might have maintenance horde. You never know. Oh, he has the mirror. I should have zapped the skeletons, but yeah, it's low enough for me to drop a naked graveyard. I want him to drop the golem barrel right now. Perfect. That's the placement you want when the Goblin Barrel is like hovering over here by the um, uh, river. You, you want to drop the bowler right here where the zap is. And the uh, Inferno is out of range. This may value Inferno if he drops the Ice Wizard. Actually, I'm gonna force on your mind. Let's see if I get the RNG. I missed a couple of skeletons, but due to the level advantage, <laughs> level advantage. He he's wasted a lot of elixir. Oh, it's over! It's over time. I was paying attention. I had a notification on my other device. Okay, and be careful now. Wow, the spark almost didn't lock on. And oh, there you go. That's how it took against Jose MB. From Alpha's Royal. Well played. GG. The game is loading so slow. 85. 100. Two crowns. One, way away, one win away from uh, Frozen Peak. Oh, one minion horde. And six giants. Okay, so thanks for watching the video. New personal best, all time highs for free to play level one. This is the record, it's been confirmed. I've been to uh, 
Galadon's um, full attack level 1 clan and I'm officially the highest level 1 player that's free to play. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video and the gameplay and see you next time, peace out.